What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, the Uncrowned Otaku. And, oh, man, one of the best death battles I think we've seen this season. The Goku Black versus Reverse Flash, hilarious. Especially how, even during the fight, I don't know if y'all picked up on this, but even during the fight, you could see Reverse Flash intertwining with the Flash in Quicksilver fight. And that was hilarious. Just the, the amount of death and carnage. Ah, oh, top two. This is... Personally, this is one of my top five death battles of all time. I thought it was, was just hilariously brilliant. Fight didn't go the way I thought it should have went. Who am I to argue? They crunch the numbers. They do the science. I'm not going to be one of those, well, this will actually what should have happened. If, I'm not going to do that. Death battle does all the work for us. Reverse flash one. I'm not even mad at it. I'm not going to give myself the caveat of time travel because even though he tried, it wasn't effective. Goku Black neutralized it, but he still lost because Reverse Flash could take the ring off. My only question is, how did Reverse Flash know to take the ring off? It looked like a harmless ring, but that's that's not the you know there. I'm sure somebody else will make a video debunking that. Uh, we're moving on. And I got to really think about this next death battle carefully because, unfortunately, your boy is on like a, a three-in-a-row losing streak, and I got to break this streak. I got to break it. And this next one has to do it for me. We have, in the left-hand corner, a drink popularized in the hood. 25 cents will get you good. Oh, yeah. When he breaks down the doors, we're talking about the Kool-Aid man. Ah! I grew up on Kool-Aid, so I know what I'm talking about. Here, you can get like a 10-pack for $2. It's crazy. And in the other corner, we have the man himself who will make you, convince you, persuade you to snap into a Slim Jim. Oh, yeah, the Macho Man, WWE Hall of Famer, Randy Savage. So it's Kool-Aid Man versus Randy Savage. And I feel like this fight is kind of like the fight of the, oh, yeah, except Rand Macho Man goes, oh, yeah, brother. And Kool-Aid Man just busted, oh, yeah. And it's kind of a, it's kind of a brawler fight because Kool-Aid Man, despite him being just a pitcher of Kool-Aid, he's strong. You see the stuff he be breaking through? And just like, oh, run through a brick house, don't even affect him. And he just happy, cheery, trying to get some kids some drink. Macho man. Besides wrestling, I'm, I'm a huge wrestling fan. But besides wrestling, I don't really know Macho Man from the Snap, the Slim Jim commercials, or any of the animated cartoons. I don't really watch the WWE animated cartoons. And I don't think the games will come into play. Like, if you're talking WWE Legends, that's, that can't be taken into effect as canon, right? It just can't be. They do crazy, they throw people so high in the sky, that's, that's crazy talk. So, I'm just thinking, Macho Man, the wrestler, versus Kool-Aid Man, the animation. Kool-Aid Man has to take this fight. I don't see it going any other way, especially the factor of, I'm sure Macho Man won't know if Kool-Aid Man is the pitcher or if he's the liquid. Now, I'm not even sure myself, but if I had to take an educated guess, Kool-Aid Man is the liquid inside because he's a representation of Kool-Aid. The product Kool-Aid is the liquid, not the container. So I'm, I'm thinking, Macho Man might break the glass and think the fight is over. And then, like, Kool-Aid Man moves all the water inside of Macho Man and then just, like, burst out of him. Kind of like an x-ray or, or a fatality from Mortal Kombat. It could be, has potential to be super duper crazy. I don't know what could happen, but I know Kool-Aid Man is strong. And Kool-Aid Man has an air of mystery around him as to how you go, will the glass break actually finish him. We don't fully know. Maybe we do, and somebody can comment down below if we do. I don't fully know. Macho Man, how strong is he? How strong really is he? Can he? Well, he has good hands. WWE Hall of Famer, that's good hands already laid right there. But can he, can Kool-Aid Man, it's kind of like, what I'm thinking is like Kool-Aid Man is roughly the thing. And... And Macho Man Randy Savage would be, who's a strong person? Who's a big bruiser? He's kind of like a Luke Cage. Like a Luke Cage versus the thing. Who's going to, it's going to be a really tough battle, but I'm giving the edge to Kool-Aid Man. He's got that, that liquid. It's the mystery. And I, I told you, I'm on a three-round losing streak. I, let me look at, let me look directly at you. I can't afford to lose again. I need Kool-Aid Man to pull this out for your boy, okay? This has been the worst season I've had for predictions ever. It's crazy. I need to start trusting my gut more. My gut says Kool-Aid Man takes this. If I'm right on this one, I'm going to always go first instinct. Always will go first. I'll never I'll never think about a death battle again if I get this one right. I'm always going to, as soon as the characters are announced, I'm going to be like, oh, he wins. And I'm going to just go with that. 
the way I used to do. I've been thinking too much this season. That's my problem. Why are you thinking, Don? You need to get out of that. Go back to go back to your roots. Let me let me take it back to when I was undefeated. But anyways, I'm over five minutes and I try to keep these short. What do y'all think? Who's gonna win? Comment down below. You wanna rub salt in my face for Lou for picking wrong on reverse flash Goku? Also comment down below. Just know I can be a sore loser. I might get salty. Come at me correct. But um it's all fun. It's all chill. One big happy community. Make sure you check all my socials in the links below. Instagram, uh, Twitch. We'll be gaming over on Twitch, watching um, The Bachelor and Bachelor in Paradise as well. Uh, what else I got? Instagram, Twitter, the Discord, all of that stuff. In the meantime, in between time, um, Dad, what's my outro? What's my outro, guys? Something about the fire that I'm not going to edit in. I don't think. No, I'll edit it in because I want to have Reverse Flash over here. No. Now, why did I say reverse flash? I want to have Macho Man Randy Savage over here, and I want to have Kool-Aid Man over here. Now, by the time I'm pointing at this, y'all have already seen it. I haven't. And you would think this would be post-production edited out. It won't be. Fire again. Lots of mistakes tonight. But I'm out.